Hey, welcome back to the show. I'm Danny Boy, and you guys are looking amazing. I want to thank you for showing up at the Diecast Garage. I've got something called the Hot Wheels Full Set Review. That's right, that's what we got going on today. And it just consists of some pop culture, some real riders, some metal on metal, and it's out of this world, my, my friends, I'm telling you. And it's a one through six full set Star Trek. That's right, Star Trek. We're going to bring that in. So uh, let's see if we can beam those cars in. Wow, that's really crazy. Check it out. One through six. Your Star Trek pop culture set for 2000 and I believe it's what, 14. Uh, da -da -da -da. Yeah, 2014. It says 13 on the back, so it must be 2014. Let's start with Lieutenant Uhura in this really, really, really cool purple 1988 Jeep Wagoneer. Oh, my goodness. It says here in the package, there's been a planetary disaster in the Sigma Quadrant. So I was warning the captain about danger. Check this out. Wow, this is a really awesome vehicle. Jeep Wagoneer. Boom! That's my first look. Oh my goodness, that thing is awesome. Purple. That is a really cool color. Look at the top is gray. You get your white interior. Light blue windscreen. Okay, that's super cool. Oh, and did I mention that this here set was donated to us by our uber super cool um, anonymous benefactor? That's right. That's right. Um, we got to say thank you. Is. We know they're out there watching. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh yeah. Love you. Um, this is just radical. I can't believe this. Um, this is really cool. Uh, look at all that detail on the front end. It'd be nice if there was some paint on there. Uh, you got your tail lights. They didn't do the headlights. There's no mirrors. But this is still really, 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 really neat. I like the red ring on the tire. And those big, beefy tires. Big, beefy tires. Right? Star Trek. Okay. Let's move on to the next one. We've got... Uh, several more to go, so five more to go. So let's get to putting this one in here, and we'll go to this next one, which is your custom '52 Chevy, and this is Scotty. That's right. She can't take much more of this, Captain. That's right. She can't take much more. Okay. Anyway, sorry. Um, this is really neat and blue. Oh, that's not gonna hold up. It's gonna knock everything down, isn't it? Okay, let's put that on the wheel real quick. Pow! And I'll fix that in the later. Whoa, we got some really cool stuff on. The side there of this custom 52 Chevy. We've got Star Trek on one side, and we've got Scotty, but on the other side, there's like a whole, you've got a whole line on there. I, I need to put, break out the old magnifying glass and read that here for you. Wow, that is really neat. You've got your blue on blue, okay? Metallic flake for the main. You got black interior, red windscreen there you get your wed, uh, red window there um headlights are done up the grill is chrome chrome wheels red ring around the wheels oh man that's some serious detail and look at all that really you get your uh, tail lights just star trek in the back wow that is just phenomenal i love the package art i love they picked some really good vehicles for this set i'm telling you this set right here is probably Probably one of my favorites. I don't think I'm gonna get that to stand up though. That's gonna be a problem. Um, it's not. I'll just put it like that for now. Uh, let's go to the next vehicle, which just happens to be right on. Mr. Sulu, okay? Uh, this is um, the Midnight Auto. Yeah, look at that package art. That is stunning as well. This car is really cool. Um, Mr. Sulu saying, Captain, I'm picking up an object of planetary size on the sensors. Oh my, because it's that guy. Okay, cool, here we go. Um, there we are. Uh, this Midnight Auto is off the hook too. Put that right there, and boom. Wow, that red is super stunning as well. Wow, this is it's some cool colors. You get a chrome base. Um, well, some metal base, it's not exactly chrome, but you know what I mean. Uh, the, the wheels are chrome, that's for sure. Red ring on the wheel again. The rubber tires there, Mr. Sulu on both sides, and he's got a he's got a script. He's saying something over here. I need to I have to check that out. Um, that's just awesome. Gold on the top, black on the top. Get a little bit of white. Just Star Trek on the back. Painted tail lights. You don't need headlights on a midnight island. Wow, that's just really hot. 
I like this car a lot. That's neat. Man, they couldn't have picked a better car in color. That's a great color combo. Goodness. Okay, we're three deep in, and this car right here is just off the hook. What's next? I mean, what could be next? Uh, let's go with the Captain Kirk 49 Ford C-O-E. Cab over engine. I believe that's what that stands for. Unless I'm mistaken. It stands for something else. Correct me, please. And this says, uh... Engage. Warp drive, Mr. Sulu. And he's saying, um, Captain... Um, yeah, we already went through that. Okay, sorry. I could just do this all day. <laughs> you don't want to do that. Dude. All right, here we go. Pow! Wow, look at that. That's a really cool Ford. Bodemus, 49. Look at that teal color. That's an aqua blue, right? Aqua blue. Yeah, chrome grill, chrome wheels, white ring around the tires this time. Okay, white ring. Um, got Captain on the side there. Is he saying something on the other side? Yeah, he's got a little, little thing too. I'm going to have to read all these. Oh, that's really looking nice. I am digging this too. Pretty nice looking vehicle in that color combo. Right. Okay, we should move along to the next vehicle, which is number five in the set. Um, as for the pictures on the back, this would be your 38 Dodge Airflow in gold, don't you know? Ooh. Yeah, the package there, bro. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. Wow, that's looking really cool. Oh, 38 Dodge Airflow. Boom. Look at that in gold and tan. That is looking really cool. I love these. I only have one other of these, I believe. And it's uh, over here, Captain America. Yeah. That's really neat. All right. Dr. Leonard Bones McCoy. What does he say in that package? Oh, I'm a doctor, not a bricklayer. Did he ever say that? When, what, what, what? Bricklayer. Okay, I'm, I'm not sure. I was hoping he was going to say something about that darn Vulcan blood. Okay, anywho, let's move on to the very last car. The Coupe de Gras. I don't know about the Coupe de Gras, but it's the last car of the set. Of our... What is it? Full set review. That's right, the full set review. And we move on to the last car, which is another really super cool, cool car. Hold on, sorry. I'm just kidding. This is Spock. Live long and prosper. And this is your 59 Chevy delivered. Wow, that is really nice. I really like it. That green is popping. Look at that artwork on here, too. That is really cool. You got your basically chromed out hood, which is probably, you know, they're, they're probably simulating the base metal, you know, that's looking really nice. Hot rod status. You got a white ring around the wheels on this one, chrome, and painted taillights. Mm -hmm. Wow, that's looking really neat. And no major script on this one. Uh, yeah, you live long and prosper. Check it out. He doesn't have a whole lot to say on here. It's typical Vulcan. You never know. You just never know. Anyway, what do you guys think about this awesome 59 Chevy delivery? And this entire set. I mean, this thing is just off the hook. Okay? Um, it doesn't get much better than this. That's right. This is Pop Culture Premium Hot Wheels full set review on Danny Boy's Diecast. Leave your comments below. Let me know which one of these cool hot rods is your favorite. There's a lot to choose from today. Um, but anyway, yeah. Super cool full set. Five. No, six cars. That's right. Six cars. Six cars. So, uh, anyway. Come on back for some more Data Boys Diecast. Awesome pop culture. Hot Wheels car reviews. And we'll see you on the next show. Peace out, everybody. Bye. Wow. Man, that's a lot of cool hot rods. I think... Oh, man, that's a toss-up between... This one here, 59 Chevy delivery, or the midnight model, I'm sorry, as far as that. Okay, that's just really crazy. Crazy!